Now, Imran Garda is here to tell us what is coming up in Newsmakers a little later. And Imran, you're actually looking at the economic policies that fall the front runners in the race for the White House, aren't you? Right. We're not talking about chicken littleism because I don't know what it means, but I'll ask Craig privately. Yeah, we're looking at whether these fringe political positions, particularly um, economically, might just spook the U.S. economy and the global economy because the U.S. is the superpower. Things like Trump saying that he's going to get tough on China and that China's cheating and he's going to, he's going to show them, you know, is that political and economic suicide. Bernie Sanders also, interestingly, sort of isolationist in his own way, saying no NAFTA, no TPP, uh, we must look after our own um, free school. Uh, that sort of thing. Is that going to hurt the U.S. economy? Is it going to hurt the global economy? Hillary Clinton, she's swaying further to the left uh, with Bernie Sanders dragging her in that direction. So there's all sorts of permutations here. Uh, ironically, a lot of people's support for someone like Trump came from their own anxieties, and that's giving the world anxieties. So there's anxieties all around. This election's never going to get boring, that's for sure. So looking forward to the debate. Yeah, looking forward to it. Many thanks, Imran.